Hi everybody, so today I'm going to be making a rainbow loom, our first rainbow loom bracelet video. Um, this is, I'm going to be, for this video, I'm going to be making a fishtail. Now fishtails aren't that um, hard at all, actually, once you get to learn how to. So the things that you will be needing is your hook, your um, loom, and um, uh, loom bands, um, uh, any color will do. Uh, I have black and blue right now. So I'm going to, how you're gonna make it is the first one, oops, sorry. The first one has to be in a figure eight. So I'm gonna take um, your first color, I'm going to use blue as my first color, and so to just twist it. So have it like this, and then just twist it. And um, I should mention that you only need two pegs for um, for a fishtail. So just use two pegs anywhere in your loom. And then add your next color. making a pattern then you want to so you should have three bands on what I do is I start out with three bands so the first the first band or the bottom band is the figure eight band and then the two other bands and then and then you can just keep on adding as much as you want I only recommend adding maybe three or four at a time not five though. so you want to take or no you should have four bands all together after you're done the first step. So um, you wanna take the bottom, the bottom, very bottom rubber band and loop it over like that. Take the bottom and then loop it over. And then you do the same. Oops, sorry, no, you don't do the same. So, Every time you're done one, you should have two bands left. You shouldn't have one or else that you won't, it won't work. So then I just keep on adding two bands every time. And take the bottom one, loop it over. Just repeat this process until um, you um, get the size you want. And at the very end, if you stay up till the very end of the video, um, you'll need a C clip. At the very end of the video, I'll show you what to do. Okay, I'm back with a little bit more of it done. So it's not that much, but it's just that much. <laughs> just a little bit. Um, so um, I'm just repeating the process, I guess. So yeah, uh, I'll be back to show you um, how to close it off later on.
gonna show you um, what happens if you um, put on five. So I put on five right now. So you take the bottom one, loop it over. Wait till you get to two. You have two bands left on your loop, I guess. The second one will not go over right. You see? It came off. So you can do it. Um, I don't know. So try, don't do five on there. Just do, um, just add two every time. It's, it's in my bed, like it's in the crack of my bed, on the side, inside. those up.
because you threw them everywhere. Yeah, put them all together then. Well, Oriana, pick the ones that you threw up. Like those over there. Those ones by the plants. Those ones can't be over there. Pick it up! Don't throw them! It doesn't matter, Rayan, you can't do that. Well, Sand, well, you have to clean it up. Now! You're not gonna find a longer one. I'll I'll do it, Dad. It's okay. Let's just stop it. It's gonna take me more than ten minutes to finish this. I'll stop it and then I'll resume it. I'll start videoing again after, okay? I'm gonna stop it. Okay, so I'm back and I finished my fish tail. So now how you want to close it off is you want to take it off of your loom. And get your C-clip. What I do is I stretch it so then my C clip can sort of just go in. So I stretch it. Push the C clip through. And so we've got all those bands in. Oops. Okay, so if you find a band that's out, just put it in. And then I'm gonna take this one. your fish tail bracelet i hope you guys thought this video was helpful um yeah thanks for watching guys make sure to subscribe and comment down below for more videos that you want us to do bye